Hi guys, it's T-Bone Pearson here, and we're going to look at a Unreal Engine 5 level that's free. Uh, but it's about here to, okay, let's go to Epic Games Launcher. It's free, but it's like 100 gigabytes to download, so I thought maybe um, someone wouldn't really want to download it, and they can just watch my video and get a sense of the, uh, the level. So we go up to here to UE5, that's Unreal Engine 5. Click that. And the levels down here, uh, get the sample. Uh, okay, no, no, no. Okay, forget this, forget this. I already have it on my computer. It was actually a little weird to get. Here it is right here. Um, so you, I've got 4.27.2 and 5 on my computer. And the minimum requirements to, to play this, they said, was a 1080 GTX card, which I have. That's the minimum! I've owned it for a while, but man, it used to be a super powerful card, and still is, but I guess the new RTX ones are the way to go. So is this loading up or what? Let's see if I have it screen here. All right, uh, down, 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 down. I got nothing right now. Hmm, let me try that again, double click. Okay, now I have the spinning wheel. Yeah, I thought I'd check this out with you guys. I loaded it up last night. And, uh, yeah, it was sort of fun. So I thought I would do a video and show you guys the new Unreal Engine. Here we go. So, again, I have the minimum card on it, but it looked pretty snazzy last night. So we're at 5% initialing. Initializing. Initializing. That is a super cool picture, by the way. All right, 17. What's it loading up here? It's Unreal Editor 5.0.0. .0. Have you guys played with this yet? I To download just the regular Unreal Engine 5, I think is about 40 gigs. And then I have the other one, uh, the 4.2, whatever. Um, so between the two of them, it's like, I think it, it says 100 and something gigs. Uh, there we are at 75%. We're almost there, guys. I'm just going to have a little sip of my drink here. Anyways, have you guys used it yet? Comment below and tell me what you're using it for. I'm a filmmaker, so I'm not really making video games with it. It's more for my web series Spell Fury. Um, so I've just sort of been researching and playing around with it a lot. We are at 96%. Let's check out this ancient temple level. All right. So what do we got going here? Um, why didn't that load up? Oh, here we go. Okay, to view the main level, open ancient content, uh, ancient worlds. Okay, so why didn't that just open up? So let's go to that that folder, I guess. Now here it is here, the GTX 1080 is the minimum. Um, so you at least need that and 32 gigs of RAM. So I have 32 gigs of RAM and that card, thank goodness. Uh, but this is what it's looking for, a 12 core CPU, with a, a, a 2080 RTX, dang, I wonder, and 60, oh, 64 gigs of RAM. So I may have to upgrade my computer. I guess I'm falling behind. Um, so we need to go to uh, the folder, um, which is on C drive and users. And we'll go into my folder here. And I think it's in, is it in documents? Um, yeah, it is. Unreal End Projects. And here it is here, Valley of the Ancient. And it said, go to... What if we, do, what if we click that? No, that's the same file. So let's look at that thing again. All right, to view the main level, open Ancient Content. I think it's just going to reload this up, yeah. Ancient Contacts Maps Ancient World. Ancient Contact... Content... Maps, Ancient World. Um, I've already forgotten. Content. <laughs> it's been one of those days. Ancient Content. Help me out here, guys. Maps. Ancient World. I guess that's it. Uh, more apps. It's going to give us the epic... I don't remember it being this hard last night. Look for another app on the PC. And let's go to, I guess it would be Epic Games, right? Oh, geez, where's five? Huh. Let's try that again. I'm not 
open with? No, not that. I had trouble with, I had to load up Visual um, Studio. I'm not sure why this is doing this and why I couldn't load it up last night. All right, so to open, da, 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 to use world partition window. Me don't understand. I don't know why this isn't working. Um, you would think, what's in here? Why can't it just work? Open with, wouldn't it have remembered? Open with, no, more apps. And we need for another app on this PC. And Epic Games, right? But where is Epic Games 5? This is the wrong, so there's no folder. Maybe we have to open up. Hmm, and I am confused. Why isn't this working? Oh, maybe file, open level. Aha, okay, file, open level. How about recent level? Ancient world. And click. Loading the map, ancient world, dot U map. All right, we're at 38%. Time for a little sippy, my drink. Have you guys played this level before? I guess it's just to show off, you know, all the improvements to Unreal Engine. I played a bit last night. It was sort of cool. So again, yeah, I wanted to do a YouTube video so I can discuss it with you guys. What do you guys have on your systems? What type of video card do you have? Geez, I thought I was doing pretty good with my 1080, but that's just the bare minimum. So 12 core at 20. How much are those? I should start looking. After this video, I'm going to look into uh, maybe getting how I do. I usually buy like someone's older gaming PC off like eBay or um, Kijiji here in Canada. Um, maybe on Facebook Marketplace. For someone who wants like the cutting edge one and then they, they've sold their old system. I usually do that. That's what happened with this, this one I'm on right now, which has been fantastic for years. But I... Uh, I would love to get my hands on that 2080. Now I know with Blender, it's nice to have the RTX because you can get like like live rendering, live like uh, these call it V-Ray, I think. All right, so things are happening. What is this? Oh, here we go. Okay, so it's starting to load probably because my card is uh, slow, um, which sounds weird because it's a 1080. I guess I'm living in the past. There's a way to, it said, change the... What was that little note down here? Do we still have one of those screens open? Okay, on lower spec systems, you can adjust the viewport screen percentage settings to get better performance. So I think I just found that there. Let's go to this here. And screen percentage, it was saying, right? Screen, where is it? Screen percentage. So is that, what's that do? So down to 50, I guess is, I was playing it fine last night. Let's go back. Whoa. Okay. We'll just put it on a hundred because I don't want to crash my system. I've turned off almost everything. All right. Let's try clicking play. All right. Well, first, I guess we can move around, right? This is, we're not in the game yet. So it is chuggy. All right. So I'm just going up. I'm holding my left and right mouse to go up and i'm using my scroll wheel to go back and let's just show you guys a level and we're in the editor editing mode right so we can actually grab things and move them right okay so there's the camera and we can create stuff have you guys played in this before um, where is, I haven't, oh, here it is here. Yeah, why can't that move? There we go. So I'm moving that piece there to the right. I wonder when I play the game, if my movement here has, has been applied. All right, so let's move that. And these, so these are all pieces. It's almost like big Lego blocks and you can move them around. 
Uh, I did a video with uh, Druinia flying on the magic carpet, and I built a, I built backgrounds like this. But let's go to play. Play this level in the active level editor viewport. All right. I did click play, but again, slow card. I love you, 1080 GTX. I guess I'm going to get a 2080. I think they're a fortune, aren't they? Let me try that again. Play. Control Alt for more. Let's see what happens there. Control Alt does what? Oh, and then maybe try clicking. Does nothing. Sort of froze on me? Yes, it has frozen on me. Is it going to start? I guess I'm recording this as well, right? So it's a little bit more taxing on my system because I'm recording as I play. Oh, here we go. All right, we've got the sound effects here. What's this say? Video memory has been exhausted. Expect extremely poor performance. Now, can you, can you guys hear that? It seems pretty loud. I wonder if I can go, go escape here. Uh-oh. Let's just go down to my recording here and make sure it's not too loud. Oh, I have, I have it down. Okay, I it might be fine. Hopefully it doesn't drown me out, but maybe that's what you guys want. Um, all right, so did I, let's hit, the, hit play again, and we're just going to go for it. Video memory has been exhausted. Uh, so it's over budget. Expect extremely poor performance. Well, what do you know? I think I have 32 gigs of RAM. So again, I got the the base, like the minimum baseline. I'm, well, I'm lucky I can even play it. No active. All right, so it's loading up, is it? It'd be fun to have a controller. I guess what a uh, Xbox controller might sync up. Although I guess I would need Bluetooth on my PC, which I'm not sure I have. Or I guess I could plug a controller right in. All right, is it starting up? Here we go. So it's looking pretty snazzy, although she's blurry right now. All right, click for mouse control. All right, so it's teaching me how to play. Left click. I'm getting nothing. Oh, there we go. All right, so she's throwing some type of magic power into the something. I can't see a video memory. Okay, still exhausted. Okay, there we go. So I'm holding on my left click, left mouse button. All right. And turbo is shift. So I'm going to hold down shift and W. All right, so I have a broken wrist. I don't... So I'll try to do the best I can here. It's healing up though. Okay, there's move. Okay, so there's turbo. Hold down shift. Wow, it's chuggy. All right. I think it's because I'm recording at the same time. Whoa, blurry. All right. And where'd that lady go? Whoa. Yeah, it wasn't like this before. This looks pretty rough. Oh, there's my rock. Hello, floating rock. Okay, what happens if I hit return X? Okay, it goes back to her. All right, here we go. So now I'm controlling her. Oh, it's loud, my headphones. Okay, I'm going to take my headphones off. It's way too loud. I'll just keep talking. I don't have to hear myself talk. So everything looks really pretty. So I'm moving the mouse around just to turn her around. And W is going forward. Spacebar jump. Oh, how do you jump? E interact. So, okay, so E. So this warps us to like the dark world or something. I guess I could. The transition may take a while to finish if this is your first time entering the dark world in the editor. Hang tight. Assets are being processed in the background and will fade back when complete. Well, there we go. Now, again, this is just a demo, a sample demo of what you can do. And Unreal Engine 5, which is pretty amazing, if you ask me. And it's free as well, which is so cool. Now, I've dabbled in Blender a bit the last few weeks. Are you guys any good in that? Do you guys use Blender at all? Uh, this is like was super easy to, to use. It's like Legos because you have all those pieces.
pieces that are already they already have materials on them they already look awesome so this thing's loading up no active level sequencer detected um, so if I wanted to render out um, like a movie shot like I did for the magic carpet you use the level sequencer I believe so you just like you can render out clips all right what do we got anything preparing textures all right here we go that was this big old dude you got to fight in here and then I guess I sort of got stuck I didn't know what to do I guess I'm thinking now to come back outside the portal that little thing when I hit E um, and then go to another one I think there was another one around so maybe I'll get past where I was last night okay are we gonna work hello click for mouse control okay I'm clicking all right, so it's giving me a preparing textures up in the top left-hand corner. Shift and F1 for mouse cursor. Okay, here we go. Very cool. It's got like a Mortal Kombat realm from the movie. I don't know if you guys remember that. Look to it. Okay, walk is shift. I thought... It is very chuggy, but very pretty. Whoa, where are you going, lady? Whoa, whoa, easy, easy. Uh-oh. Okay, shoot. I think because I'm recording, um, it's chuggier than usual. So to shoot, hold down the button. Ooh, that's fun. All right, so I'm just going to make my way. Okay, so she just did that all by herself. Whoa, she's out of control. Now there's a big baddie up here. I'll, I'll show you. This is a little annoying because it's so chuggy. Hey guys, let's try that thing. I'll go up, wait, dang it. I don't want to hit escape because it'll jump me out, but I should have lowered the percentage before I started the level. Okay, so she, where are we going? Oh yeah, through here. You blow this up. And then you can go through here. And then there's a big bad guy. Let's go! Where? Whoa, easy. She's drunk. Okay, keep going. He's in this pile. Oh yeah, baby! He's pretty easy to fight art if I remember correctly it looks awesome though okay let's do it I think you just hit him in the head or something I remember him being fairly easy all right dang it Uh, let's try it again. I think it's that in his belly. It's hard. It's so chunky. There we go. All right. So stomach and then head. Wow, my speakers are so loud. Now that would look good in real time. I may have to get a new computer, but it's going to cost me. Anyways, guys, I think let's stick with that for now. It's a little annoying because it's because I'm recording at the same time. So, yeah, what do you guys think? It looks super pretty. Um, yeah, feel free to download this from the site. It's a little tough to get going. It's about 100 gigabytes, and then Unreal Engine 5 is, I think, 40 to 50 gigabytes. So you have to have lots of room. And we have texture streaming over max. Anyways, guys, let me uh, get out of here, and uh, thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, let me know. Let's talk about Unreal Engine. And I will chat with you guys soon. I'll just end my OBS thing here. And what time? Okay, we have lots of time.